Welcome into Time Out with Tubby, presented by Southwest Bank. Alongside head coach Tubby Smith, I'm Adam Doyle. Coach, I know you're not in the business of moral victories, and I'm not going to make you such, but mm -hmm. at the same time, the way this team has played this year, you've been so close in so many games, so a lot to play for, and, and how far you've come from last year. What are you most proud of about this group here? Well, I'm, I'm proud that they're playing more as a team. Our sister turnover ratio is better than it's been since we've been here, so we're taking care of the ball better. You know, we're shooting the three, but even though we've struggled the last, you know, in and out, we've been up and down with a few of our players, especially some of our better three-point shooters like Devontae and, and, you know, Justin, although Justin's shooting well in conference play, he's starting to pick it up. You know, we're not getting – so there are a lot of things. We're down in our rebounding, obviously, without Norris, Odiasi, and then the last game, you know, and, and not having Matt – the last you know, part of the game uh, at Texas. But I'm really proud of how we're defending, even though you know, we're scoring more points this year. Everything is up pretty much, so, so I'm really proud of the team. Keenan Evans the other day goes for 14 points in just over 26 minutes. He was 7 of 10 from the charity stripe, and I know that's something that at the beginning of the year he had, he had struggled a little, a little bit in. But the whole team, like you said, almost everything is up statistically. Second in the Big 12 right now in free throw shooting. For him personally and the team in general, is that one of the main things that you guys have improved on the most? Well, and it's important that Keenan keep attacking the basket and we keep attacking because that's one of that was our emphasis this year was to get to the free throw line, force people to foul us, and us not foul. So we've we've done a better job there. And Keenan really played well against two outstanding, probably one of the best backcourt combinations in the league in uh, Javon Felix and uh, Isaiah Taylor. So I was impressed with his ability to get to the rim and get fouled and make his free throws. Iowa State comes to town. The second time you played them this year, you'll play them Wednesday night in the late game on ESPNU. The first time up in Ames, two minutes to go or so, it's a four-point game. You guys had a chance in a very difficult building. This one will be a different game. Jamil McKay won't be here. Obviously, Norrence Odiase not in this game as well. A couple different variables, but round two now. How, in your opinion, do you, do you make sure that round two is different than round one? Well, we've got a, you know, get off to a better start. We were down 18 before we even knew it up there, but we battled back and cut it to two. A couple calls go our way late game, we'd probably win the game, but they didn't. So we have to make our own breaks. Uh, we've got to uh, take care of the basketball. Um, you know, they're number 14 in the country, so you're going up against one of the best teams in the country. And in Yang, you're having one of the smarter, most crafty, one of the most crafty players in college basketball. And Monte, Monte Morris is a, is a great point guard. I mean, he's an NBA point guard who's second in the league in assists. Uh, and he's playing extremely well. You know, so even without Jamel, he, they're still a very talented team. And Burton, who's really stepped up and played well for them, Dante Burton, who's, who'll probably start for them, is averaging eight points and, and, and playing well. So in, in, then they're, they're an excellent three-point shooting team. we got to get out and guard the three against Matt Thomas and people like that. So uh, we'll have our work cut out. That's an area to where we struggle defensively and defending the three. Thanks for your time, Coach. Thank you. All right, Texas Tech hosting Iowa State 8 p.m. on Wednesday night. You can watch it on ESPNU, but why do that when you can come out and watch the Red Raiders live in person? Hit your tickets online at texastech.com or by calling 806-742-TECH. Hope to see you here Wednesday night. For Head Coach Tubby Smith, I'm Adam Doyle. That was your timeout with Tubby presented by Southwest Bank.